back again. And you? For a grand reopening, I assume. Evolution's in a rut. Natural selection at an all-time low. Shipping out fresh meat will incite territorial rages again. Will strengthen and advance us. Even create new breeds. Kind of evolution on steroids, then. A kick in the pants. Those runts Qualapec and Tihokan had no idea. The cataclysm of Atlantis struck a race of languoring wimps. Plummeted them to the very basics of survival again. It shouldn't happen like that. Or like this. Hatching commences in 15 seconds. Too late for abortions now. Not without the heart of the operation. No! really has sort of reached her goal like you can't ask for better than what Batman offers to her essentially it's not just all of the knowledge that she could ever want in the past but it's also sort of real real ultimate power right so um and the culmination of uh, sort of her father's quest to find this artifact her father's quest and then you know it leads into the mother's quest from the legend as well so it's it's really major and because we'd pushed how far she was willing to go earlier on with the last I wanted really for the player to wonder even though it's basically a remake therefore we know what choice she's going to make that she fundamentally is a good person that, uh, that that would be a really tough choice for her to make when she does finally throttle back from her own obsessions and, and choose a good path I think um, it makes it a real moment Obviously, uh, after you kind of understand what it is that Nat has been up to, we wanted to sort of show in the original um, sort of what the extremes of her sickness would create, you know, her mental sickness. And this, this sort of weirdy, freaky torso boss fellow was uh, what we came up with. I think uh, having him sort of shuffling around after you is, is pretty disturbing. I agree. He was, he was my favorite boss in, in the original and I think my favorite boss in the, in the new one, in, in Anniversary. He's just so gross looking and the way he moves is all freaky and mutated. It's cool.
so uh, thank you for playing through Tomb Raider Anniversary and uh, listening to uh, all of the director's commentary. Yeah. It's been uh, actually moderately fun. Yeah. <laughs> and if, uh, hopefully you didn't mind listening to us yap on and uh, you garnered some bit of information that you were actually uh, interested in about the uh, history of Tomb Raider and the remake. And, uh, that's it. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thanks. Another, but you, Lara, you have lost everything. <laughs>